Hello everyone, this is Sai Chiran from Tech Deep Dive. Um, so in this quick uh, uh, video, we are going to cover how the uh, filtering of the dashboard works and how the fasting behaves uh, when you're opening the dashboard uh, from the links uh, and how the faceting works, all that stuff. Um, so uh, this is a small dashboard that I've created. Uh, it's pretty much simple. So I do have uh, a single global filter and uh, uh, like three to four widgets where uh, the fasting is set to uh, different things. Like here I put it as include, the fasting is include. Um, here it is an exclude and uh, this one is set to uh, the none and this one is set to all okay so I've, I've selected the fasting to different options like the four available options and also there is a link um, that is uh, that will open a dashboard uh, external filters new dashboard that I've op uh, that uh, I'm opening that dashboard from the link uh, over here so let me open the external filters new dashboard so it's pretty much simple it doesn't have much detail so it just have two two chats uh, where uh, one one fasting includes to all the other one fasting includes to include uh, apart from that there isn't much uh, complexity here so uh, let's see how it behaves when you click on the uh, the uh, lead source and uh, how the filters are getting passed uh, we'll, we'll see that so I'm going to select uh, a lead source from all to employee referral um, so everything is smooth uh, like all the filters get applied um, lead source filter is getting applied over here and uh, you can see all the values are getting changed to lead source also let me click uh, open uh, external filters dashboard and see how it behaves so if you look at this one um, so when you click on this external filters dashboard uh, only this widget uh, has got the um, the uh, filter applied but not this widget um, if you if you click on the show details uh, you would definitely see that uh, that that particular filter is getting applied over here but not to this filter if you click on the show details the filter did not apply so this is interesting thing right so when you are clicking on a link uh, for one widget uh, the filter is getting applied for the other widget uh, the filter is not getting applied um, so let's take it to the context of uh, when you embed this dashboard what will happen and how the filter is applied um, so I have embedded this dashboard over uh, the home page on the sales application. So uh, this is my uh, application, how it looks like. So let me close this analytics dashboard for a minute and I will come back to this again. So let me refresh this page. Okay, so uh, I will go ahead and apply employee referral over again. again. Um, so everything is smooth again so all the widgets got uh, the filter get applied and uh, let me click on this open XML filters dashboard so it will open up it in analytics studio and uh, uh, the result is same um, here you got two here he got 31 so because uh, the filter is not applied over here again so this has become interesting right um, so uh, at the same time so uh, not only this uh, when you click click on this uh, open analytics studio um, you, you will see something different here right so I, I will go ahead and click this open analytics studio button and uh, if you observe the initial dashboard something strange is happening here right so um, uh, the filter is not getting applied uh, over here too so um, so the fasting wherever we set the fasting is all only the filter is applied over there and uh, rest of them the filter is not applied even though the filter is applied over here so one little thing if you observe over here so whenever you click on a link uh, and if it is navigating to a dashboard so those um, whatever the filters that are applied over here will be passed as a external filters to the the external filter it will pass it as external filters on the opening dashboard what I mean by that was if you click on this uh, open analytics studio um, that this particular filter whatever the global filter we applied over here that will pass as an external filter over here so this passed as an external filter you can clearly see it over here for the external filters to work on the widgets the fasting should be set to all apart from that if you set to include exclude none the filter will not get applied so this is a documented behavior so if you go ahead and see it over here when you open a link dashboard the past global filters appear as a external filters so this this little thing is applied to uh, open in analytics studio link also so when you open this uh, um, the dashboard when you click on this open and open in analytics studio those global filters are passed as a external filters over there and there is one more thing that uh, um, that interesting thing here is like uh, to apply external filters uh, when you open a dashboard 
the, uh, you have to set the fasting as not all otherwise um, uh, the fa the filters may not apply so how it behaves is like the filters aren't applied to embedded dashboards when fasting in underlying query is set to include exclude or none so it is very much important to understand uh, the what is a fasting value that you have kept so that uh, uh, the the global filters will apply when you actually open a dashboard from a link or uh, from anywhere if you have embedded the, dash the dashboard and if you try to open it in analytics studio the uh, the behavior changes uh, depends upon your uh, widgets faceting value hope you like this video i think i i believe this is informative um, just let me know in case if you have any questions i'll try to answer them thank you